The classic science fiction Star Trek showed characters beaming from one location to another. Can this happen in reality? Scientists are working on studies documenting the advancement of sending or teleporting information faster. Quantum internet allows information to transfer faster and more securely. So what is the future of quantum internet? Can it only exist in the realm of science fiction or will it in fact become a reality? Weon's broadcast partner Voice of America has more on this. When news spread late last year that the Fermilab National Accelerator Laboratory in suburban Chicago was part of a project achieving quantum teleportation. Now, Doctor. It conjured up scenes from the classic science fiction franchise Star Trek, in which the show's characters could beam from one location to another. That's not what we're doing here. What we're doing here actually is we're moving information without even physically moving the qubit that contains the information. Fermilab scientist Pangiotis Spensoris is one of the co-authors of a study documenting the advancement of sending or teleporting information, or qubits, a unit of quantum computing code, over 40 kilometers through fiber cables. It brings developers one step closer to building a sustainable and widely used quantum internet, which would allow a lot of information to be shared faster and more securely. Quantum communication has very appealing attributes. I mean, you cannot um, eavesdrop in, in a way that will not be detected. What we achieved here with the systems is that we have produced systems that they can continually operate and perform um, uh, quantum measurements at, at all times as a system, not just as a single experiment. Physicist Maria Spiripulu, based at the California Institute of Technology in Pasadena, California, says quantum teleportation could sustain networks that enhance GPS and speed up and amplify communication at great distances with spacecraft and probes, among many other possibilities. While building a new quantum internet would revolutionize the way we share sensitive information, the physical technology to make it all work is still in its infancy. You try to make them forward compatible so that when material scientists and condensed matter people give you more um, instrumentation and devices, more advanced devices, that you can plug them in. In 2020, the U.S. Department of Energy laid out a blueprint for a national quantum network using its 17 national laboratories, including Fermilab, as the central network for the project. Scientists and researchers say it represents one of the most important technological frontiers of the 21st century and hope to implement it in the next decade. There has been a lot of investment worldwide and in the U.S. for, I want to say, 30, maybe 40 years. Um, it is well funded and uh, explored. And there is both industry and academia and government that has invested. But experts say today's technology, which only teleports information, the barriers between quantum realities are breaking down is still a long way off from realizing the dreams made popular by Star Trek. It doesn't mean that we can beam up Scotty or anybody else or a cat or anything else. We cannot move matter right now, and if we ever manage to do it, it's going to be with a different process. A process that, unlike quantum teleportation, still only exists in the realm of science fiction. Kane Fairbaugh, VOA News, Batavia, Illinois. Co-presented by Skoda. Simply clever. Beyond World is One is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news updates on the move.